If you struggle with shyness or social anxiety, check out our free no BS training course with actual useful advice you can do from home. None of that just get out there nonsense. The link is in the description below. For now, let's get to today's question. The question, are there cases of social anxiety and depression where medication is the only solution? I wouldn't ever say only solution, but medication is often a good solution, and sometimes the best solution. I think that people with anxiety slash depression in particular have trouble getting started with therapists. It's just part of the makeup of that particular combo. Making appointments, figuring out insurance, meeting strangers, sometimes it feels just too much to handle when you are also barely functioning. Furthermore, if you have a bad experience with your first therapist, it's very 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 hard to believe that another can be better. When you are depressed and anxious, it's hard to move on from that. Medication is great at making you function better so you can address the root of your situation. Sometimes people can get by without medication. Of those people, they tend to focus on therapy and lifestyle changes. And if you are in this group that's great no shade from me. However, if you are not in this group, you are far from alone. I was desperate to avoid medication, and my prescriber heard my family history, and gave me a lol, that's a nice goal, but that's not realistic. You, you can be without medication, or you can function. Unfortunately you don't get both. I have a serious family history of mental illness, and I believe that for some mental illness there is a significant genetic component. I have inherited a terrible genetic legacy, so medication is the foundational solution for me, and one of the best ones. If you are also in this group, there's nothing wrong with that. Find more answers and a free audiobook on how to talk to anyone in the description below. No useless advice like just get out there I mean actual useful advice from people who have really dealt with shyness and social anxiety and overcome it in their own lives.